everyone, welcome back to That Is My Opinion with me, your host with the most is Soap Cal's Times or Raindrop, April Showers. Today we're recapping and reviewing episode 6 of Canada's Drag Race. And let's welcome my special guest this evening. She has turned many heads in the drag scene and she's giving many opportunities to baby queens. Give it up for the one and only Whisper Six. Hi guys, I'm so excited to be here. Thank you April Showers for having me. I you are, you. you're literally an icon. She said icon. I'm not that icon. Icon. Icons are for old people, babe. You know it's not. Great. Honestly, I, I promise can... you, you are um, ageless. You are timeless. I need more filler, ladies and gentlemen. Me too, bitch. I have not one. I have like one. You're like 21. You're like a baby. I'm 23. I'm 23. Yeah, yeah, I'm turning 24. Still young, one. ladies and gentlemen. How are you, Seth? I'm good. I'm chilling. I'm good. How is um, coronavirus treating you? How is it treating anyone? Right, that's what I say. Um, what have you been up to? Um, I've, I've been showing, uh, I've been actually working on a lot of things. I've been working on, so you guys, I'm a high school dropout. Me too, beauty school dropout. <laughs> so Stay I, in school. I've like been working draft. on like getting my diploma. Okay. And then as soon as Corona is eradicated, I'm gonna go to cinema makeup school. Because I would love to do uh, makeup for like film. Well, this is all right, ladies and gentlemen. Get into this. Yeah, mug. It's look Come at on, you. mug. Wait, show the audience your mug. Give us face, give us face. And we're wearing pink. <laughs> we are wearing pink. Yeah. We didn't even plan this. No, we didn't. I just pulled it out of my um, suitcase and said, We were know. like, pink, pink. We didn't even know. I love it. You look gorgeous, then. You look gorgeous. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, anytime, bitch. I'm ready to read some bitches and spill the tea. Remember, this is her opinion, ladies and gentlemen. This is my opinion, that's her opinion, and it is what it is. So you guys, you just gotta take it for what it is. I love it. Honestly. All right, so um, let's get started, yes? Wait, do you wanna like do a, like, a little cheers? Oh yeah, let's do a cheers. Okay. Yeah, we're drinking some cheers. wine. We got some little wine. Uh, <laughs> it is uh, thanks to Coke and uh, Miss Baby Long Legs. They're not really good at toast, so, um, are you? Are you just I am. Cheers. Okay. Um, I want to give a toast to Miss April Showers. Come on, April Showers. She is the icon in the community. She has been around for a long enough time to stir the hearts of many. Great. You're calling me even old. No, I'm just kidding. No, no I, I, I honestly, you. bitch, uh, let's cheers to you. Because cheers. you've been doing drag and you've mastered it. Thank you so much. Yeah, so I'm you. so happy to be cheers here. Cheers to me and everyone who's into water sports. Period. Cheers. Uh, yellow, what's it called? Gold golden showers. showers. Yeah, golden, golden showers. showers. That's my, that's my drag name now. April showers, golden showers. Mayflowers, June bloom. <laughs> Period. All right, cheers, then. Cheers, babe. All right, so we are now on episode six of Canada's Drag Race. We have seven girls remaining, and last week we had to say goodbye to Kiara. We got another lipstick message in the mirror, and Miss Kiara had to sashay away. Do we agree on Kiara getting set home? And thoughts and opinions on her Mariah Carey. <laughs> so I, I don't think she should have been in the bottom for Mariah Carey. Um, I think she was definitely like one before last. Okay. Like it wasn't that bad. I think um, Boas was a little offensive. Yes, Boas was a little, uh, was a little, yeah. It did not age well as time went along. On the internet, we realized that uh, everybody's mad about it, everybody's frustrated, and um, yeah. it just it I, wasn't the I best. would have to say, it was I, not tasteful. I disagree with you. Just disagree with me. I thought her Mariah was tragic. I think she could have done 10 times better. Um, I thought Boas was okay, but she could give even more, even more dark humor, because mm -hmm. I went to the dark humor. If you watched the last video, we, we love dark humor. We love dark humor. Yeah, dark humor. Um, but I do think Kiara deserved to be in the bottom, and I do think she deserved to go home. Um, I think she deserved to go home. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Because, um, sadly the judges played a little ploy on her, where they looked at Priyanka the entire yes. time. However, I thought we were going to get a double Shantae. Me too, but I, I just really think that uh, probably Kiara would have done a lot better if she felt like the judges were paying attention to her, all of her accolades. Yes. She overdid it because she felt like they were not already validating her, her drag. Yeah, and that looks like they, they were like, oh, Priyanka, Priyanka, Priyanka. Like, 
Yeah, I mean, come on. <laughs> and that is your opinion. That is your opinion. <laughs> All right, so moving on. Uh, we got our mini challenge of the season, of this episode of the season. They have many, many challenges. Um, and they have to play psychic operators. So the funny thing is they don't know who's calling. So like, oh, there's gonna be a special guest. We don't know who it is. I thought it was gonna be Michelle Massage or someone Love. else from the US version. I but wish. we got Crystal from UK's Drag Race, ladies and gentlemen. Loves. Um, it was cute. I mean, they called in, they played psychic. They um, did. I used to pretend I was a phone sex operator when I was like 16, ladies and gentlemen. So I know how this whole game thing works. At 16, I was actually like 17 and a half, almost 18. So <laughs> yeah, it was cute. It was a cute mini challenge. Yeah, um, I would have rather Carson Cressley. Carson Cressley. That would have been a oh, great, God. like, yeah. I just, I was like, wait, that's not Gothic Kendall. That's not, like. Yeah. But I think they picked Crystal because she is originally from Canada, but then moved to the UK. So, like, oh, that's I was like, oh, whatever. It's Crystal. Like, <laughs> yeah. Saying I wasn't, like, shook about it. I wasn't shook. Crystal's cute. Yeah. But it was cutesy. Um, it was cutesy. Carson would have been great. Or, uh. Michelle. Michelle. Real. And, like, oh, Ilona Verley, we're gonna have her lip sync to Boa with scars you're beautiful yeah because she has the tattoos she is she's literally the like she's like look at me like these are my scars i'm beautiful like that's in laura's brand yeah so i think that they really set that up yeah and i i think alona was perfect for that and i think they know that she was yeah. perfect for that yeah Boa, Boa to me in the lip sync was meh. Meh. It was meh. really yeah. meh. And I really liked Ilona because you could see the emotion in her eyes. Like she was fighting. Because that song for was meant for her. And when it comes to lip sync, that's what I like to see. I want to see a girl fight. I want to yeah. see her give you every emotion in that lip sync and be like, bitch, I deserve to stay here. Embody. Which I was a disappointed in Boa because I really liked her too. And I was like, bitch, you need to fight for She had a lot of storyline. But she was just holding back, yes. She did, especially with the story about how they she They gave her a lot yes. and she did not. Yeah. Follow through with what they gave her. Yeah, especially her recent story in this past episode when she took someone home and they pretty much exactly her so and beat her, which yeah. it was rightful that she went home. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. they gave her so much and she gave that little. Yeah. Um I was I was a little confused. A little confused. <laughs> Just a little confused. They gave like she they gave her every like storyline. They said, here. We're gonna give you all of this, right and then she gave them nothing. Okay, I can see that. I can yeah. see that, because she was in her head. Yeah, she, she was in her head. They kept and feeding her all these things, and she was just like, Like, bitch, she got yeah. the storyline. Yeah, I And she didn't it. give it, I so. So, on the lip sync, Ilona stays. Ilona stays. And Boa goes home. Sorry, Do Boa. Do agree or disagree? I agree. She agrees, and that's her opinion. It was, uh, it was... Perfect. Yeah, I just felt like to me she gave up at that. She did, she and like, um, the song was perfect for Alona. Yeah, and I, I, I can see it. It was spit for Yeah, her. and it was like... Whether or not it was premeditated, it was... It was her song. Yeah, it was her song. So thank you so much for joining me, sis. Of course. Yeah, so I want to get your thoughts and opinions on the whole season so far of Canada's Drag Race. I think it has stood a big match to um, Drag Race, RuPaul's Drag Race. Okay. I think that it has really showed its individuality. Yes. And I feel like watching it, I'm like, oh my god, I want to be on Canada's Drag Race. Oh, okay, so look. You know what's so funny? I was talking to my friend about this. I said, I want to move to Canada. So I can be on two Canada's. on three years. I want to be on Canada's Drag Race. Just because I do like how it's so individually different. And it's so, it's very true to the early seasons of Drag Race. Yes, no it, it's, it's just very no genuine. Overdone. Yeah, very genuine and I like that. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. And so Canada, everybody's really nice and girls. friendly and it feels like we're starting over. If you're looking for two girls, Canada gives us a couple. Canada, please. But I mean, hey. I'm Whisper Verley. But hey, Ilona was living here and then Lemon was living in New York, so hey, you never know. Who knows, Whisper Verley. Yeah. I love, I love it. I love it. Thank you so much for joining me, sis. Of Thank course, you. Baby. Looking stunning in pink. Pretty in pink. Um, I want you to drop your Instagram. Where can we find you? What you have you? What upcoming shows you have? Give a shout out. The world is watching. So you guys can follow me at at Whisper Six W H I S P E R S I X X. That's where you can follow me. And um, I, um, all Instagrams are everywhere, right? Twitter, period. Grindr, period. Craigslist. Grinder, Craigslist, um, 
Christian Mingle. Christian Mingle, okay. <laughs> yes, Christian Plenty of Mingle. fish. Plenty of fish. Yeah. And um, yeah, it's just a blast. Really. Do you have any upcoming shows you want to promote as well? Yeah. You have a competition go show going on right now, right? Every week. Every Every Thursday. Thursday on yes. Tiger Instagram? Yes. So okay. every Thursday we have a little competition. And everyone who wins each week goes on to finals. Okay, come on, finals. Yes, so we have eight performers who win each one of their weeks, and they all go to finals. finals. So April What's is- What's the next challenge? April is going to be judging. Yes, I did your comedy challenge, which you is so did, much fun. And she's going to be which doing this so next one, which yes. is Miley Cyrus versus Anna Montana. Oh, come on, best of both worlds. Best of all the worlds. Nobody's best perfect. Worlds. I got to work it. perfect. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody makes Everybody mistakes. Has mistakes. <laughs> So, April, so you know the tea. Yes. So you know the tea. Mom. You, yes, you are so still ready to give the girls, like, the truth. Oh, no. The you truth are. Nice, but that is our opinion. I'm waiting for you to give it to them. Oh, my God. Thank you so much, girl, for joining me. Thank of course. You. Also, I one more question. Class. Um, what eyeshadow are you wearing? Oh my god, April! How could you? Who's, who is this palette by? And then this one is whipcrack.mv3. Okay, come on, whipcrack. By who? This palette is a custom palette by Hip Dot. And uh, it is from Meatball from Dracula Season 1. Who? Meatball. Who? <laughs> Meatball! <laughs> Love Sometimes I say the same thing. Who? Oh, but guess oh what? God, no. I I cannot ignore talent and meatball. This palette is iconic. I love and meatball. It, yeah. Send me a palette. Meatball. We just want everyone. to thank you for giving us this history because this right here. If she doesn't send me a palette, I'm gonna tell everyone that one time I saw her in the back alley in downtown LA. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Meatball, we yeah, love meatball. you. Congrats You're gorgeous. Girl. Congratulations. Yes, I love it. Period. Yeah. On, the, on the count of three, we'll end with period. Yeah. Period. Ready? Okay. One, One two, two, three. three. Period. period.